Duncan Riley here again for TechCrunch, and we're back in Second Life today to look at BidSL, a new auction uh, startup which is promising to deliver eBay style auctions in Second Life. I'm just standing outside the headquarters of BidSL at the moment. There's, there's not an awful lot to see. As you can see, it's a, a reasonably impressive building, high set perhaps on some sort of island. We're a quick tour of the facilities and how it works. We'll just walk in here through the entrance, and on the left, you can see the general information about BidSL, how it works. There's a, a lift now directly uh, slightly to the left of me which actually takes you uh, upstairs to the adults only area. A notice board there. I'll just walk across here now. As you can see scrolling just slightly to my left is the BidSL auction boards um, and all along the walls are also uh, auction units. Now an auction unit essentially is a, a script within Second Life, uh, a vending machine for lack of a better term that allows you to run an auction. And at the moment, it's well, it's very quiet. It is totally new. We've got the first auction here. It's got on the scales auction. The current bid is eleven dollars, uh, lindens, I should say. Now if I left click on there, it gives me a, a note card. I've got the option to to keep it or discard it. I'll keep it. Discard the second one, and it talks about a uh, Damien and Uni are the product of unholy unions with a couple of unicorns. Um, now, <laughs> I'm not sure how many uh, people would be interested in, in buying something which is the unholy union of unicorns, but th that's the first item up on BidSL. A quick wander around here. There isn't an awful lot to see, unfortunately. Uh, it's a, a two-story thing. These are the, the bidding units. If I wanted to uh, basically rent this unit, I'd left-click on it. Um, it gives me some details there. If I right-click on it. Well, that's not going to work. It's the problem of doing this on a laptop, a Mac laptop, which doesn't have a right mouse button. But if I was to right-click on it, uh, it would actually allow me to uh, pay money to the, the the auction unit to rent it, and then I basically will just drag the item in there, and, and Bob's your uncle, you have an auction. Now, a couple, a couple of other things also. Uh, these units here can actually be franchised. Noted in the post, uh, they actually charge... Um, I think a, a small amount basically to franchise these units. You, you get the building, you can even have the complete copy of the building currently standing in if you own land in Second Life. Um, all in all, I mean, it, there's not an awful lot exciting to look at yet. It, it's very new. It, like anything in Second Life, I suppose you've got to start it somewhere. Um, the long tail is always very long. Um, so I think, you know, people are going to eventually embrace this, that it's going to have users. Um, it's never going to be another eBay, I don't think, but uh, you know, good on the folks uh, from Ohio who have actually created this. It's a husband and wife team, um, and let's see if it goes well. That's bid ourselves for TechCrunch.